Hey, good morning. Welcome back again. Um, we're Sunday morning right now. It's the day before Martin Luther King um, uh, birthday, basically. So it's the 16th of January, 2022. Okay. Now, I want to talk a little bit about the finances on the tax sales. Okay. Every state and, and county basically works differently of how they do the finances. Okay. Here in the state of California, most of the auctions are held on bid for assets. You have to send in a deposit in order to bid. Okay. And you got to put a $35 non refundable fee. Okay. That's just a bid. Now, if you win, you're going to have to send the whole thing in. Okay. All the money in. Okay. To get the deed in California. Okay. Now, when I went to North Carolina, okay, I went to a tax sale and it was a deed sale. So North Carolina is a deed sale, okay? And you show up and you only have to put down 20% at the auction, which is usually held at the courthouse steps, okay? But you can wait for it to go to the court and you can do an upset bid and it's basically 5% of the uh, bid amount at the court. So this person might be putting 20% down. Um, he might be putting $5,000 down. I can go to the court and only pay maybe $1,000 down, okay? Now, the only thing about North Carolina is somebody else can come in and upset you, okay? Or pay a higher price than you and then you gotta keep going back and forth all the time. But if your capital is limited, North Carolina is a great state because you don't have to give them all the money right up front to control the property at all, okay? And then it takes you like another 30 or 60 days or 90 days before you gotta send in the balance. Compared to here in California, you gotta give them a, a deposit, okay, $35 non-refundable, and you're gonna give them all the money in 30 days, okay? So check it out. Every state is different. I wanted to give you that little information. Hope you liked the little video. If you do, please like us, share the video, consider subscribing to us, okay? Until next time, we'll see you then.